gourmet leftovers. Today we're going to be making an oven roasted spatchcock chicken with baking powder. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to cut the backbone out of this chicken here and then lay it open with the breast side up. And then we're going to take some unsalted butter, about a half a pound's worth, and we're just going to melt that in the microwave. In the meantime, we're going to take about a tablespoon of baking powder, and to that we're going to add about a half a tablespoon of salt, about a half a tablespoon of fresh ground black pepper, a half a tablespoon of garlic powder, half a tablespoon of oregano, and a half a tablespoon of thyme, and finally half a tablespoon of basil. So we're going to give all those a little bit of a stir up there. set that aside. Now back to the chicken. We're going to take our little injector and we're going to go nuts injecting butter everywhere you like to as much as you like. I like to get especially a lot down into the dark meat of the thighs and stuff but I'm just going to keep going until I can't get any more and then I'll just clean this mess up a little bit while I try to wipe off some of the excess there. Now we're going to throw that on a greased um, wire rack this will help keep the chicken out of the juices and let it go extra crispy and stop it from going kind of like rubbery and soggy on the bottom side. And then we're going to rub in all that baking powder mixture. Now it works best if you refrigerate it for an hour or two and just let the baking powder kind of soak in any juices on the skin. Then you're going to bake that at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 175 degrees Celsius until you get to an internal temperature of about of at least 165 Fahrenheit just let that rest and you've got a really nice crispy skin on that chicken lots of flavor herbs now we're going to carve this chicken up here serve it up buffet style and then just take a look here when we cut this one open just look how juicy that chicken is honestly baking powder has become my best friend when it comes to chicken a little bit makes a huge difference if you haven't already, I recommend checking out the uh, videos on uh, baking powder chicken wings. That's where I first got led onto this. And there you go, all the juices and the butter inside the chicken. And that skin is oh so delicious. Well, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider subscribing to the channel. In the meantime, check out some of these other videos, and we'll see you next time.